Hey guys, it's me Tristar and today I'm going to be showing you how I turned this sketch into this painting. Now this is a character from my illustrated novel Dusk Rider. It'll be coming out sometime in April, so be sure to check that out. I'll provide a link in the description below so you can check it out and see if you like it. So let's get started. I took a photo of my sketch, brought it into Photoshop, and then set it to multiply and I left it the, as a top layer. That way when I lay in these colors, I can still see my line work. And I'm mostly sticking on the lower end of the value spectrum to keep the colors together. I'm not going too crazy with highlights right now. I'm just laying in shadows and midtones and just getting pretty dark with it. I'll lay in the highlights later. And I'm taking this opportunity to really adjust and fine tune some things that were off in my sketch. I laid in a darker background to help with the atmosphere of the piece. And I started to put in a little more of some highlights. I put in a simple sun behind her, that way it could cast some reflective light around the edges of her form, and that really helps show a 3D effect to the drawing. It allows me to separate her jacket and those really dark areas from the background so they don't just bleed in. And sometimes you do want that, but in this piece I wanted to really show some dramatic lighting. And her hair, I made sure that it would cast a shadow along her face, and those shadows and the lights, those really help bring forth the shape of her facial features. And her eyes, I made those green just to contrast with the purple color tone that was everywhere else in the piece. I did some last minute adjustments here, and really got into some details on the face. I'm just sharpening up the shadows at this point, and then I added in some color dodging effects just to really make it contrast. And throw in some dust particles in there just to add atmosphere, and here is the final piece. I added some motion effects to it to really bring it to life even further. So anyway, thanks again for watching. I'll have a link to my Kickstarter page below 